Sufia Khan from the Center for Peace and Spirituality and the topic of today's discussion is deserving candidate for paradise. Paradise is described in the scriptures as the reward for the righteous. But paradise is not anyone's birthright, nor will one receive entry into it through recommendation. Entry into paradise is totally a matter of selection. And this selection will be done by God Almighty in the hereafter. So who is a deserving candidate for the eternal world of paradise? The Quran gives the answer to this question in these words. He will abide forever in the gardens of eternity through which rivers flow. This is the reward for those who purify themselves. Paradise is an ideal society. The purified soul is one who develops his personality according to the culture of paradise. The qualities that are required in a purified soul are given in the Quran in detail. Paradise is described in the Quran as Darus Salam or the home of peace. According to this, every member of the high society of paradise will be a peaceful person. Only that person will be selected for paradise who has proved in the present world that he can live in society with peace and compassion. No experience whatsoever would develop the slightest feelings of hate and violence against anyone in his heart. A scene from paradise has been given in the Quran in these words, the God-fearing will find themselves in gardens and rivers, in the seat of truth with an all-powerful sovereign. It means that the people of paradise will have the qualities of truthfulness and sincerity. Similarly, regarding the culture of paradise, the Quran states, They will not hear therein any vain or sinful talk. Anyone who does not stand up to this criterion will be declared as disqualified from entering paradise. About the sublime society of paradise, there is a very meaningful verse in the Quran which states, Whoever obeys God and the Prophet will be among those he has blessed, the prophets, the truthful, the witnesses for God and the righteous. What excellent companions these are. This verse shows that the society of paradise will be a collection of the best individuals from the whole of human history. Every member of this society will possess the fine qualities of positive thinking, peaceful behavior, sublime character, truthfulness and sincerity. So paradise is a perfect world and only Perfect character will find entry into paradise.